Hello and welcome to Polaris channel. Starting from today, we will be learning 3ds Max and Photoshop with me, Ala Ashahed. So let's start. And if you like the video, don't forget to subscribe and like my videos. Thank you for watching and let's start our first lesson. What we're going to do today is to get our copy of 3ds Max. So let's go to autodesk.com website then let's, let's scroll down until we find education community or education uh, let's see yes education community click here now at the left side we can see a free software okay then again let's go to student software and choose what your type of uh, university or school or high school or secondary school then here we can find all what all programs we are able to install we are looking for 3ds max <laughs> As you can see, it's a free software, and you will get free three years lessons for the 3ds Max. So let's create our profile. Fill all your information here, with your first name, last name, your email address, everything. And when you done, come back again to the, the same page. And this time, we uh, will find we will be able to download. So let's choose the version of the Max. We are going to install 3D Max 2014. This is a new one, but we are going to install this one. So change the language to the English. And choose your version for Windows. Now we'll get our serial number and the product key. Make, uh, make sure to save this information in your desktop because you will need it in the future and click here, install now after uh, the install start and the download start you will get the, the, the icon of 3ds max on your desktop so click on that icon to start the max After the installation of your 3ds Max, you will find you the icon of the program on your desktop. Double click on the icon to launch the program. Then we, you will be facing this interface with this welcome window screen. Uh, this welcome screen will appear every time you launch the program. On the left side you see this column showing you short movies, very helpful for any startup in the program to, s to show him how to zoom to create to edit and assign material and others in this one you can uh, if you click here you can see what's new in this version of, two th uh, of 2014 3ds max on the right side you can click here to se set a new empty scene or to open one of the latest project you were working on so let's start with the new empty scene Now, first, uh, you can see here this four big screens showing you the viewports where you can see your model from top and front and left and perspective. From at the top uh, left side, we can see this max icon. If you clicked on like any program, you can see new, open, uh, save, save as, import, export, just like any program. And these little icons is the same but shortcut like open scene, open file, save, undo, and redo. We will we will be talking about everything next um, lesson. But before we go to next lesson, let's set the se uh, unit setup in the 3D Max to meters because we are going to use this uh, measurements from today on. So go to customize unit setup make sure you select metric 
meters then go to system unit setup and select centimeters hit ok ok again another, th another thing to make sure we have it is the gamma so let's go to customize preferences gamma and LUT make sure it's enabled and the gamma is 2.2 hit ok the gamma will be fi will fix our colors for all the screens to match as uh, as max as, as possible for all the screens so that's it for today see you next lesson bye bye